Hey guys, it is Arika Misha and I just wanted to do a little quick video of a little quick dinner idea. Um, and tonight for dinner we have the Publix combination pizza snack rolls. And let me see, this is the combination which is the pepperoni, pork, and chicken pizza topping with sausage style seasoning in a golden crust. And we also have the pepperoni pizza snack rolls, which is the pepperoni and a golden crust. So we've got the pepperoni style, and let me show you guys that. And we've got the combination style. And we also have Publix. Y'all know I love Publix. So Publix sweet potato fries. I love these sweet potato fries, guys. They're so good. And we also have the Publix restaurant style fries which is the extra crispy french fried potatoes so this is a quick middle of the week dinner idea you guys could fix and they're all Publix products and Publix products aren't really that expensive um i think the pizza snack rolls were two for ten which isn't bad um and the fries were two for five so can't beat that so get two and you can make a couple meals um and i'm gonna go ahead and cook all of this in the air fryer all of this is going in the air fryer so you we can make it you know what quick get in and get out so it is a weekday so this is what I'm doing just giving you guys some middle of the week dinner ideas for the family so all right guys I will be back let me go ahead and get my air fryer together and get everything situated so we can get everything taken care of and cooked for dinner I'll be back Okay guys, I am back. I've got everything all laid out and ready to go into the air fryer. I have my sweet potato fries. I did spray them with my old faithful Publix canola cooking spray. It's the six ounce. You guys know I always use this. Um, and I just sprayed my uh, sweet potato fries, put my parsley on it, and I put a little, I put my parsley flakes. Parsley flakes, I got these from the Dollar Tree. And my french fry seasoning. Y'all know how I do. And I put some of that, the parsley and the um, french fry seasoning on there. Got both of those from the Dollar Tree. Put those on there, sprayed it with some oil. And then I put the seasoned salt and the parsley on top of sweet potato fries. And also the regular fries. I sprayed them with the oil. Um, and I put the french fry spray. Um, I'm sorry, the french fry seasoning and the parsley flakes. Those are already seasoned up as well. And we've got in the back back here, I just put them in a bowl for now, the uh, pepperoni uh, pizza, little pizza rolls. And I have the combination. Got them in their bowl, ready to go in the air fryer. So I've got my air fryer all ready. So we will go ahead and dump. We're gonna, uh -oh, got one left still in the bowl. Gonna go ahead and dump. Our pizza rolls and these are the pepperoni ones now I've already lined my um, air fryer with aluminum you guys know I always line my air fryer with aluminum just a thin layer not gonna hurt nothing I've been using this air fryer for years you can put aluminum aluminum foil at the bottom of your air fryer guys it's fine not gonna hurt anything so um, I went ahead and lined my air fryer already. I also sprayed some oil down there so, you know, your food don't stick. So, what I'm also going to do, let me get my canola oil here. Sorry, guys, trying to do this. I'm going to spray, spray the top of them with my canola oil. Go ahead and get my air fryer. And it is automatically set to 360 for 15 minutes. My air fryer automatically sets at that time. Of course, I can change it and adjust it, but I'm not going to. I'm going to go ahead and leave it at 360 for 15 minutes. Let's get it started. So I will be back when my timer goes off to check on these guys so we can see how they are coming along. Um, in the air fryer, it's going to make it quick, quick and easy, guys. Remember my philosophy in and out of the kitchen. So that's what we're going to go ahead and do. And I will be back to check on those um, pepperoni pockets. 
Okay guys, the timer just went off on our air fryer. So let's see how our pizza rolls are looking. They look good. Let's get you guys over in there so you can see. They look good. My lighting here. Horrible lighting, I know. Okay, those look good. Nice and little brown around the edge. Let's go in and see. Now those look good. Let me see. Grab one. Oh yeah, those are nice guys. Look at that. Ooh, hot, hot, hot. Hot, hot, hot. All right, those look good. Give them a little shake. Shake, shake, shake. But they look good. They look real good. Nice and toasty. Don't want them too hard. Can't enjoy them if they're too hard. So, give you guys a close look at that. Hot. But you can see it's nice and golden brown on both sides. I flipped them over. Nice and brown. So, let's go ahead and we'll get these dumped out. And let's go ahead and get the other ones in. Let's see here. I'll leave you guys over here to look at the... Let's just see. Put you guys over here for a second to look at them in the air fryer. Guys, look at those real quick. Let me go get a plate. Let's get our plate ready. Let's get our plate all napkined up. Let's see. Let's get our basket out. Okay. All right. Getting my basket out here. And I got my plate over here with my napkin on it. We're going to go ahead and just dump these out. It's nice and crispy. Oh, yeah. Those look good. Those look real good. Get my basket back in my air fryer there. Could give you guys a good look at those. Those are looking nice. Look at that, guys. Those look really good. Hot, hot, hot. Those look really good. Take you guys in for a closer look. Spin it around. Nice and golden brown and toasty. They look good. He's still hot, so you know they gotta cool off, so I don't wanna mess with them too much. They all hot. We'll let those cool off, but doesn't matter because right now we're gonna go ahead and get the combination ones in. So Let's get, we'll keep our aluminum foil in. Gonna spray it. Spray it with our oil. Let's get the combination ones dumped in. Alright. Get these spread out. I'm telling you, my lighting is horrible in my kitchen. It's kind of hard to hold the camera and film, but. I like to give you guys a good look, not a far look, you know. So we're gonna get these in. Got those all nicely spread it. Gonna spray them at the top with our canola oil. They are ready. Put those in the air fryer. All right, we're gonna keep the 360, but we already know how long they're gonna take. So we're gonna put them at four minutes and we'll come back, flip these over. And I'll be back when they get done, guys, so you can see them. But just going to give you a good look at these. And as you can see, as they sit, they get a little bit more brown, you know. They get a little bit more toasty. So giving you guys a good look like I always do. It's a good thumbnail. But yeah. No pizza pocket. Publix pizza pockets. And these are the pepperoni ones. The pepperoni and cheese. So 
That's what those are looking like. Something quick. And you know kids love pizza pocket. Kids love pizza, period. So, And that's what they're looking like. So we'll wait for the combination ones to come out. I'll get those over here as well. And then we'll get those fries in. Our sweet potato fries with our parsley and seasoned fry, seasoned fry salt. And we've got the regular fries back here. All right. And as you guys see, I see that I have the fries sitting out. And while they're sitting and waiting to be cooked, they thaw out, you know. They're not so frozen when you cook them. Makes your cooking time quicker. It's not going to hurt them to sit out for a few minutes while you cook the pizza pockets. The little, I'm sorry, little pizza rolls. Not going to hurt. So, like I said, it helps them thaw out. So, by the time you get them in the air fryer, they've already thawed out. Cooking time is quicker. So, I will be back, guys. Okay, guys, I am back. I just took the combination little pizza rolls out. And this is how they look. Yeah, kind of looks like the pepperoni ones, but they're like a little darker. Um, but this is the combination pizza rolls. This is how they came out. They look good. The combination ones over here. And the pepperoni ones over here. Alright, let's move on. Um, I'm going to go ahead and get, give you guys a close look at those sweet potato fries. I love sweet potato fries, guys. They taste good. I mean, you think they taste like, well, they do taste like sweet potatoes. Don't get me wrong. But they just taste like sweet french fries. That's what it tastes like to me. Sweet french fries. And all I do, I season them up like they regular fries. Separate these. I want your fries sticking together. They taste just like, um, I season them up. They sweet, they sweet potatoes, but I season them up like they regular fries. Got my parsley and seasoning and everything on them. Get them all spread it out evenly here in, in my air fryer. I love sweet potato fries. Oh, let's put our oil on top. Just a little bit, just a little bit. Don't want to overdo it. Don't want to oil, oil too much oil. So I'm going to put the sweet potatoes and sweet potato fries let's see we're gonna keep it at that 360 I'm gonna put these on 10 actually let's put them on six because the air fryer is already hot so let's put it on six we'll come back and check on them see how they're brown if they're brown enough we'll go ahead and shake them up and put them on for another six minutes all right so we've got our Pizza rolls all done here. Got the pepperoni combination. And we've got our regular fries back there ready to be cooked. We'll throw them in after we do the sweet potato, guys. We'll be back. Okay, guys, I am back. We've got about one minute left on our timer, so it should be going off soon. Um, I did already flip the fries, shake them up a little bit. Um, I'm going to go ahead and do that again. Yep, it's our timer going off. Look at those. Ooh, look at those. Put you guys in for a nice look. Hmm. Let me zoom you guys in. Look at those fries. Nice. Let's get some light on them. Ooh, those are nice. Nice and brown. You guys hear them? They are fizzing. So, oh, and they smell so good. Sweet and salty. Just gonna shake them up. Shake them up, guys. That's all I'm doing. Shaking them up, making sure they, you know, get all nice and flattened out. And I'm going to put them back in. But I'm going to put them back in this time. Let's put them in for, I'm only going to do about, let's do, let's do three minutes. Okay, so the sweet potato fries, I put them in, all of them of course, I put them in for five minutes, flipped them over, and I just, I just shook it up like you saw me do now, five minutes, shook them up, and I'm going to do them for three more minutes, so it's going to be a total of eight minutes, and they should be done, like I said, they're going to cook faster because they were already sitting out, you know, thawing out, so they're going to cook faster, it's not like they're frozen, frozen, they've been sitting out while I've been cooking the other stuff, just a little trick help you get there faster you you learn a lot of things when you're cooking so 
So, um, those should be ready and should be out in three minutes. And I will be back so you guys can see and we'll go ahead and get those um, regular fries in. I'll be back guys, thanks. Okay guys, let's go ahead and get these out. They are done. Look at them. They are done. Look at them. Look at those. They look so good. They smell sweet and salty. I love sweet potato fries. They're so good. You just got to cook them right. And they just taste like sweet fries. That's all. I eat them with ketchup. Just like they're regular fries. I put a little seasoned salt. My little parsley on them. Get some light in there for you guys. Look at that. Sweet potato fries. They taste so good guys. Alright. Let's get these dumped out. Let's get the basket out. Hot, hot, hot. Got my plate ready over here with my napkin. Let's get them dumped out. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Hot, hot, hot. Basket back over here. You guys see them. Sweet potato fries. They're so good. Uh -huh. That's a little burnt, but I got a cute one. Mm hmm. So hot. I'm going to pick it up. I'm just going to show y'all. Mm mm mm. It's so good. Okay. It's so good. Mm hmm. Nice. It's so good. Okay. Sweet potato fries. A little seasoned salt and a little parsley. Hmm. You got some fancy fries. <laughs> oh, man. I love it. What's this? Mm, hello. Hello. Sweet potato. Mm, whatever. Mm, mm, mm. Still looks good. Ooh, that's hot. All right. Let's get. Ooh. Let's get the regular fries dumped in here. Mm, 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 mm. Them sweet potato fries are so good. Let's get these regular fries done and we will be finished with this meal. Mm, get this done. Go ahead and get my oil. Got our fries all sprayed down, oil down. We already got our seasoning salt on them. Let's get them in. All right, we're going to put these in. Get my air fryer right here. All right. Let's put these on. We're going to put these on 10. Air fryer already hot, so. Let's zoom you guys back over here, these sweet potatoes. Sweet potato fries. Mmm. -hmm. Ooh, wee. Nice and hot. Mmm. -hmm. Look good. Mmm. -hmm. They are so good. I love sweet potato fries. They're so good. Alright, guys. So, the next time I come back, we're going to be bringing those other fries out of the air fryer. You guys have seen how it's done. Air fryer quick, 10 minutes, 10 minutes for the sweet potatoes, 5 and 5. Put them in for 5 minutes, shake them up, put them back in for another 5 minutes. That's it. The regular fries, uh, I usually put them in about 10 minutes, shake them up, and then you only got to put them in like another 2 or 3 minutes. So, all right, guys, when I come back, I'll be showing you the full meal. Okay, guys, we are back, and I have taken the regular fries out of the air fryer. So, we've got our fries all completed. We've got the regular Publix French fries um, done. Took about 10 minutes, 5 and 5. And the sweet potatoes, same thing, 5 and 5. So, those are our fries. All nice and golden brown. Take you guys in for a little bite. That little golden brown peeking up at you. And those sweet potato fries. They're so good, guys. They're like a little sweet, salty taste. And we have got our pizza rolls. Got the pepperoni pizza rolls over here. And the combination. All right, guys. This is a weekday uh, dinner. Something quick that I cook for the girls. Easy. Simple. Thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to follow me um, on all my social media. Media, I'm sorry. The uh, Rika Misha on Instagram. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to this video and to this channel. Thanks, guys. And remember, knowledge is power.